If you're having some issues with your PSP or if you want to sell it, then you'll want to hard reset your PSP beforehand to reset it to factory default settings so that it feels as good as new. And in this guide, I'll show you how to factory reset your PSP in two different ways. First, if your PSP is in working condition, then you can reset it from the settings. So head to settings first and then go down to system settings. Then we'll need to go down again and here's the format memory stick option. So if you want to erase your memory stick too, then you can go ahead and format it from here. And after that, just go down to restore default settings. This will show you all the settings that will be reset to default. So if you want to proceed, press X and then select yes to confirm. And press X for the last time so that your PSP will restart and reset itself. But in our case, if your PSP is not working normally and you can't access the settings page, then we'll move to the second step. For that, first make sure that your PSP is turned off completely. And you can do that by holding the power slider upwards until the power LED goes off. And after that, you need to hold the triangle, square, select and start button together. And while you're holding them, flick the power switch. Then keep holding them until you see the screen turn on. Now your PSP will reset and you'll end up in the setup mode. So you can set it up and use it normally or just give it away. So that's so simply you can hard reset your PSP to factory default. If this helped, give us a like, follow us by subscribing and keep on gaming.